The ocean is a vast and powerful beast. And when paired with a storm, it creates waves that travel for hundreds and often thousands of miles to meet their end. A rocky coastline, a shallow reef pass, or perhaps a tropical island. But one of these waves in particular could earn you a seat amongst legends. It's how late the drop is. It's how critical the wave is. It's how big it is. It's, did he almost make it? Did you give those wow factors that the judges are looking for? Wave of the winter goes to... psych mode right now. We're gonna cruise upstairs. Bombs are rolling through a pipe. Oh my god, look at these jets coming through right now. Wave of the Winter is a really cool competition. You got four months of the best waves in the world that arrive on these beaches, like in the center of Mount Miracle, to get Wave of the Winter. It's not just pipeline, but it usually boils down to pipeline. sitting on the edge of your seat the whole winter. Oh, man, I think I got the one, but there's still December, January, February, you know, like you don't know what it's gonna be or what, what the outcome's gonna be. We're about to pile out of pipe. The waves are picking up. Nate already beat me out there. And when you're looking to try and win away with the winter, you need to tick every single box off. The wave needs to be eight, 10, 12 feet. The drop needs to be heavy. Into the barrel it needs to be like, man, I'm not sure if he's gonna make this. It spits, it double spits, and then you're like, no way, he's coming out. And then you come out, then you have a chance at winning with it. So in a period of four months, 750,000 waves come through on the North Shore, and that's probably just like a general wave average of every 10 to 12 seconds, and I got really lucky. That's one thing I can tell you. And the waves are absolutely firing. I just came in, and look at this. Oh my god. Best day of the year going down right now. I got two absolute amazing rides. Probably the two of the best waves I caught in a long time at Pipe. For me, it's a dream come true to win the Wave of the Winter one time. For me to win Wave of the Winter two times and overall performer two times in 10 years, it is a dream come true. And I feel blessed. Uh, another winner here on the North Shore and another awesome win. And you know, it just goes down and my life history books. And I, I really want to show you guys like in the room that we do all the editing, like like a little step-by-step -step playthrough of a couple of the waves I caught and the things that were going through my mind. It was just like crazy. So I'm gonna cruise over to the editing room. Come on, let's go check it out and we'll figure this out, how I made it. Here we go, wave of the winner, wave number one. Check this out. So right here we have Reef Macintosh 
sitting out the back for that maybe that 12 footer that will actually cap out the back. That's what I think he was thinking right there in his mind. He was a little too far out, but really well positioned. Right here on the right, you got Koa Rothman, which he's pretty much in a really good spot, but somehow he's letting me paddle for the wave. Right here, we have Danny Fuller, um, one of the best pipeline surfers ever right here on my side. And I think at this moment, as I've been waiting for a wave for a while at this time, and it was my time. And if Reef didn't catch that wave, I was gonna catch it. Um, so then kind of going through here, I, I some maybe a straying guy right here. I'm like, I remember at this moment right here, I'm paddling and I'm just, just like, come on, one more paddle. And like, just, barely got into it and right over here on my right is koa smith he was just as committed as as i was and he won this wave really bad so i said ho oh! <laughs> and um so so right here as i start the drop i'm thinking oh my god i'm really deep i'm setting my line and i kind of start air dropping a little bit right here this boil you'll see it in about 95 percent of um, the really good ways that go down that pipeline. This boil has something to do with everything and where we're lined up. And it's one of the like most iconic things when you're out of pipeline, you're like, oh, I'm deeper than the boil. I'm really deep. So I go over the boil and sometimes going over the boil could like kind of like mess up your board because there's a lot of water pushing from underneath and then you're like trying to go through it. So as you can see kind of right here, as I go over the boil, I catch a little bit, but I, I knife right through it I'm applying so much pressure on my front foot right here to do the biggest pump I can. I'm kind of adjusting a mid face. I'm gonna just kind of ride this thing down and, and hope right here. I, I adjust, I do another pump because I realize I'm really deep. And as I'm coming through right here, I'm starting to think, oh my God, this wave starts getting really thick inside. As you can see on the GoPro clip, when, we, when you saw that in this video is right when it just started getting beautiful and I was like, okay, like I see the vision, it just starts spitting and it spits hard. And, and right when pipeline starts spitting like that, you can't see anything. You pick one direction and you just pray and hope that that's the direction that you need to go. It's like, it's like this crazy like rainstorm. And as you can see, I kind of drop out low because I knew like maybe something could happen. This thing might be closing out at the end. So I drop low and I, I was like, oh my God, I made it. And it spit again. The craziest thing is I didn't claim the wave. I kind of just did a nice high line carve right here. And I was like, oh my God, that felt good. And basically right here is celebration. Boo! <laughs> I just jumped and I was like, wow, that was insane. And I just remember popping up and just going, whoa, I think it's time for me to go in. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that wave I got all in it. Boom. I think that wave won me wave of the winner, but we're gonna go through the other clip that went down 20 minutes before that actual wave, which got second in the wave of the winner. Let's check it out. Okay, crazy. Reef McIntosh, uh, Koa Rothman, Nathan Florence, Flynn Novak, Eli Olson. This is a really tight, gnarly lineup. To get waves from these guys or around these guys is a really hard task because they are some of the best, if not the best pipeline surfers that ever surfed out here in modern day. Um, so right here, this, this set actually shifted a little bit more north. It wasn't really deep on the peak, so I was kind of in a lucky spot. You can see my track comes around right here and it ends up right here. Once again, right next to Danny Fuller, right next to Benji Bran. It's a really tight lineup. Um, Moana Jones. This this lineup at Pipe is just crazy, man. To get a wave is really a dream come true. And a wave like this, this is what dreams are made of. So right here, I'm paddling. I'm pretty much like quarter down the face. I start looking at it and I'm like, oh my God, this is gonna be really steep. On my right, it's a little Ferrero looking. The, he must have had the craziest view because right here, I was like, if I don't make this drop, I might die. Like this, this right here, how gnarly 
this situation is for me is as heavy as it gets at pipeline without wiping out. So here we go, I'm gonna run you through it. Boom, right here. Look at this, look how late my foot comes up on my board. Last second, boom. I'm like air dropping now. My fins are completely out of the water, still air dropping, still air dropping. Nose is just hooking in. Board still sliding down the face. I'm just holding on for my life right here. Right here, I'm like, oh my God, I made the drop. Is this gonna get easier? No. So I start pulling up as hard as I can because if I don't crank on the rail as hard as I can, the lip's gonna take me out and in a matter of half a second, I'll be on the reef, just getting smashed. So don't want that to happen. I'm pulling as hard as I possibly can on this rail and pushing so much weight on my front foot. And then it's just right here, I'm like, I set my line, I'm like, oh my God. And literally this barrel just went white. It just like, it, it was a full white out. And as I'm gonna play this clip, it spits, it spits, I come out. We're gonna show you the other angle of that really quick and just to show you how deep I was actually in that barrel because usually you don't make these waves and this is why this was top two for Wave of the Winter. This is a really cool angle, this wave. Look, look how steep it gets right here. I fall out of the sky right there. I crank as hard as I possibly can right here and then I set my line and look at this. You can see me a little bit. The wave starts breathing back. I can't see anything. I'm on the foam ball, like hoping I'm gonna come out. It spits. I don't know where I am. I realized like, oh my God, I'm gonna make this barrel. And I was like, literally so surprised. I was just like, boom, that was for you. And you know, these are the waves that really matter to me in my life at Pipeline because they're the waves I didn't think I was gonna make. And my whole life growing up here is I would like to know that I'm gonna make these waves, but when you get the wave of the winner, you don't think you're gonna make it from point A to point B. It's like, it's this crazy feeling that you get. And yeah, right there. I hope you guys enjoyed me breaking down winning wave of the winner. Um, I, I can't believe I got two waves like this in 20 minutes. Literally, a dream come true, and I'm blessed. Woo! That is a wrap. We are making dinner here on the North Shore. Yeah. Hi, Tina. Yummy. Say hi to the vlog. Hello. But you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. It's a very crazy time in our world right now and we need to listen to the local guidelines and everybody, please stay safe. Much love from Hawaii. Um, stay safe. Peace and love. Later. See you on the next video. Woo! And the winner of the 2019-2020 10th Annual Wave of the Winter, O'Neal Wave of the Winter goes to What up, Nate? How are you I just woke up. Hey, just woke up. Dude, dude, I'm just right now. Oh my god. Like legit as good as it gets. Dude, I saw one that was like, like absolutely psycho. And there's no one out. Are you going out right now? I'm going out right now. Meet me out there. Oh, I just, look at this one. Woo! Yeah, let's go, let's get it. It's gonna be so fun. Woo! I'll see you out, I'll see you out there. All right, late. Bing! Okay, Nate Florence just called me. First time the Bulldog called me all year. Um, Psyche and the waves are pumping. It is possibly the best day of the year right now. And um, yeah, we're gonna get amongst it. Um, I'm gonna throw on my suit of armor because Kind of one of those days where it's just really heavy, really gnarly, but you can get the most beautiful, perfect wave of your life.